guys, it's Shell with Creative Shell Bear, and here is my first stamp set. And today I'm just going to make a card using this one. This one is called Party Goats. Aren't those cute? So I'm just going to use the little girl who's kicking up her heels, and then I'm going to use a couple of the other sentiments. So let me show you what I'm going to do. Uh, I am starting with a five. 5x5 five five square card base, so I just cut it at 5 by 10 and scored it in the center and folded it. And then I cut a 4 and 3 quarters and 4 and 3 quarters square, and then that will go on top. But I'm going to set this aside, the base aside, and we're just going to work on the square for now. Uh, I have a little piece right here, and this is 2.5 by 4. So what I'm going to do with this one is I am going to emboss it using this little uh, flower embossing sh um, cuddle book folder. So I'm going to emboss this. So let me go do the, or let me do that real quick. Get my embosser right here. And this will just add just a little bit of dimension. You can use any embossing folder that you want. Um, I just wanted something that was kind of busy just to kind of draw your eye to the back a little bit so and it's just this cute little I don't know if you can see that there they are cute little flowers set that aside okay and so I'm gonna just put that on here I'm just gonna use a little bit of my art glitter glue To glue that down. I'm just kind of putting it off center to the left just a bit. Okay, so I'm going to set that aside, let that dry for a little bit, and I have a circle that I cut out uh, from the cuddle bug. It's about a three inch circle, and I'm going to use the little girl goat that I think is absolutely adorable, and she fits perfectly on this little circle. I just made sure that, you know, I was using the right uh, size. And I am going to use my use my archival jet black ink, and we're just going to stamp her on here. Get it. I think my ink pad's kind of <laughs> drying out. So I'm going to see if I can get a good impression here. And that looks really good. Okay, I'm gonna set that aside. Isn't she cute? I love this sentiment. I came up with this. You know, I, like I said, I was looking for uh, some little, a little goat, um, some goat stamps, and I just couldn't find anything that I was really looking for. So I just made up my own. So I have this bag. And, you know, you could certainly reuse it um, just by reusing the bag. But I really wanted a little sheer fabric on her little tutu. And I'm going to just cut this down so that I have a little bit of fabric for her tutu. And I need to color her in so that she has some color to her. Okay, I am using antique linen, and that would be the most um, color of her. And then I'm also using vintage photo, which will be her little hooves and her probably her uh, horns. So I'm just using the antique linen. I'm not doing a um, you know a bunch of blending or anything like that. 
I just want to give her a little bit of color. Okay, sorry about that. My memory card was full. <laughs> so what I did is I just used this worn lipstick to color in her little shoes and her mouth. And I'm just going to come in and just do a really, you know, light color on her tutu. We're going to, um, you know, we're going to put some, some material over that anyways, but I kind of want it colored in. White isn't showing through it. So I'm using my Wink Estella uh, brush pen and I'm coloring in her little shoes. Isn't that cute? Okay. So I'm going to do that and then um, remember those, the little bag that I am reusing. Here it is. So that's going to be part of our little tutu. So I'm just going to kind of do a little gather in the material. You can use anything for this. You don't have to use anything. I just thought it would be really cute. I'm going <clears> to <throat> cut off out the little um, ribbon here. And then I'm just going to attach that to our little piece of our ribbon here using some art glitter glue. The art glitter glue. And this will just give us a little bit of, you know, I'm all about just kind of having different textures and layers. I just think it's cute. And, you know, to kind of make it. Uh, tutu out of, you know, the fabric maybe that, uh, you know, a real tutu would be out of. I just think that would be so cute. Okay, so I'm going to gather that up, possibly. Okay, let's figure this out. There we go. I'm just kind of fold it on itself. Just kind of um, gathering it on itself. It's kind of hard. It'd probably be easier if you had like a piece of paper, I mean a needle and thread first. But it's not totally undoable. I'm just going to hold that down and add just a bit more glue. Oops. <laughs> kind of measure it and see what I think. Ok, 
Okay, once you have it kind of tacked down, I'm going to come back with another piece of the little ribbon and actually I'm going to fold it over. So I have this extra right here. Fold that over. dry for just a second and then we're going to cut it down to size Isn't that cute? Okay, so I'm just going to use some more tacky glue or some more art glitter glue. And I'm just going to attach this like that. So it has a little bit of, def of um, height, then. Isn't that cute? And since I still have some ribbon, I think I'm going to make a little tiny bow for her hair. That way we can just use whatever we have. So I'm just going to make a little bow. Isn't that cute? So this is just going to go in her, in her hair. I'm just going to make a little tiny go disc. I'm just going to put it right here. Some art glitter glue. <laughs> Isn't that cute? I think she's turning out adorable. Okay, so I'm getting my card base. I'm going to set her aside, let her dry for a minute. <laughs> I love how she's turned out, though. Okay, so I have my card base. I'm going to go ahead and use my uh, art glitter glue and just put that, um, our pink piece, the border on the top of the... Okay, I'm just going to put our uh, paper down. Or backing down. Okay, and I have this really pretty ribbon, and I just cut a dovetail in it. I just think it's so pretty. So I'm going to um, put this one down right here. I'm just going to put a little bit of glue right here. This will be covered up by the by our little girl. And we're going to use our little goat, and I'm going to use some pop it dots, pop dots, and we're going to pop her up. Isn't she just adorable? Okay, and I'm just going to put her right here, popped up. Isn't that sweet? I'm loving this little card. Isn't she just so cute? <laughs> okay, and I have some little pink gems. 
and they actually pr are pretty close to her little tutu and her um, little ribbon. So I'm just going to pop these, pop three of them up here. And they happen to all be attached, so that's just perfect for what I need. Isn't that just so cute? Okay, and then I'm going back to my stamp set, and I'm going to use the sentiment that says, Kick Up Your Heels. And I'm going to stamp that on the inside. a perfect print. So this is the first first stamp set and this is called uh, Party Goats and I just think it's just an adorable little stamp set. So be sure and check out the link below if you're interested in maybe purchasing to see what else I have for sale in the store. And thank you guys so much for watching and you guys have a great day.